and that whole collective unconscious thing I think is wonderful because it makes sense to me that, you know, we've evolved and we have inherited certain biological and genetic predispositions. Why wouldn't the mind have done that too? And I think, you know, from a contemporary, just from a very simple to understand perspective, most people in the world, although they would not necessarily consciously state that, for example, they're scared of spiders. If you see a spider jump at you, we're all going to jump. Now, obviously that's embodied and there's a physiological response to that as well, but we would all have some kind of fear of spiders because our ancestors evolved to become afraid of them because they could kill us. Now, to me, that's one way of understanding the collective unconscious from a very simplified but true um, aspect. Yeah. Yeah. Another good example is religion. You know, religion was first, oh, there's this, there's this God in the sky. And then all of a sudden he came down to earth. There's this man walking on the earth. And what Jung said in his answer to Job is the next phase, you know, the higher level of consciousness is we're all embodying that same, that spirit, mm. um, the, the, the one in a sense. So, um, you know, the same way. And then real quick, I want to mention this because you, you really brought this up in my head and I never thought of this. A lot of doctors nowadays, they're giving medicine out. A lot of these, especially mental medicine, mm. are they trying it themselves? Because I don't think they have, you know, and, and you think about Jung, he's doing his psychology, trying it out before he gives it to us. Uh, it's a mm. lot of respect that, that I give uh, the Jung. And a lot of people, real quick, I do want to mention, he was a psychologist and he was a scientist, but he had to play the part to get this information out. He truly was yeah. a mystic in a sense. Mm. His true roots are mystical, prophetic. Um, and, and he, he was clean. A lot of people I see asking, oh, was he on cocaine? Was he doing LSD? He was very clean during his whole process. So mm. uh, there's a way to access this realm clean. I, I do want to mention.